Welcome back to Thistle Hill Farmstead. Today we have another furniture build. Right behind me here, I have a shelf that I'm going to put together uh, to be up in our bonus room here that you see behind me. And it's going to store just photo albums and some books and other things. So it's a quick little build, but I thought I'd bring you along and let you uh, see how it goes. If you like this video, remember to press that like button. It really helps me out. And subscribe keep up to date with all of our videos and ring that bell notification so that anytime we post a new video, you'll get notified. So here is the unit. It is, um, from it's a signature design from Ashley, as you can see, uh, it is a bookshelf that is a three tier bookshelf. And I'll open the box up here in a bit and we'll start the assembly process. It should be a quick one. It's only three shelves. So hopefully it's not going to take very long at all. So the first thing I want to do is, uh, set it down on the floor the correct way and get the box open. Let's see what we got. Uh, it says this side up. That's interesting. It uh, has a little indicator here that says do not use a razor blade. But uh, how do they expect you to get it open if you don't cut it open? Uh, don't understand that. I guess they expect you to tear it open with your fingers maybe? I don't know. Uh, but I'm going to use a blade anyway. Because I'm just a rebel. That's the way I am. Okay, so let's get into it here. Let's see. Well, it says this side up, but it does look like that this top is, would be easier to come off if I flip it over. So I think I'm gonna do that. And again, like I said, because I am a rebel. That. Seems like it's coming off better that way. Alright. Off to the side so that uh, we can use that for all of our scraps. Uh, okay, looks like it's packed really well. Let me, uh, this looks like this is for our hardware. Corner protectors out. Cut these little pieces of tape with my illegal boxy knife. Tell you what, I'm gonna cut this side too. So that, because this stuff, man, I hate this styrofoam. It breaks, comes apart, and then those little pieces are all over everything. So the less I can disturb that and break it, the better. Looks like it's already broken a little bit on this edge, but we'll just go with that. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. Happiness inside. Not instructions, but happiness inside. You know, um, I'm like most people, and you see the instructions, you immediately toss them to the side. But... Uh, that's a good way to get you to look at it. It's kind of got my attention. Okay, let's unbox it and see what we have here. Make sure everything is in one piece. Let me back up a little bit so that I'm in camera all the way. Oh yeah, I'm still there. It's cardboard to protect it. That's good. Piece. See what I'm talking about about this foam? This stuff gets all over everything. Pretty much have to vacuum it up to get it off. There's another shelf. It's like uh, electrostatically charged. It sticks to everything. Okay. Uh, here is our box of uh, bag of fasteners. Keep that 
pack uh, some other blocks of styrofoam. Those here are looks like the, the sides of it. So we're going to pull these out. Okay, the wrong side. Oh man, styrofoam all over everything. There's one. Styrofoam that we don't need. Some uh, little side pieces, and I do, I see already, I like that these have stickers on them to tell you. Uh, oh, that's a little sharp right there, that edge. Okay. Um, they have the stickers to tell you what part they are. They uh, are in plastic. So they are well protected. And we've got a lot of these. Makes me feel like I'm back in school. Cause I got a lot of these. Not the sharpest tool in the shed. But I made it, believe it or not. High school was not so fun, but then I, Wound up going to college, doing good there, and then even went on to get a graduate degree. So there you go, just to go to show you that you know, a lot of kids don't apply themselves in high school. And I was one of those, I was a jock. I was more concerned about football and sports than I was academics. But then you become an adult and you learn you have to make a living. And unless you're a super jock and can on a professional team, you have to have something else. And I was not the super jock. So that's when I decided, hey, maybe I better pay attention to this school stuff, learn a trade. So that's uh, that's what I had to do. Okay, so here's the last shelf. I'll just put that right in front there. And that looks like that's it. Hey, I've got a sticker here. I wonder where that went. I'll keep it. Oh yeah, it looks like there's a couple stickers on here. And they're coming off. Yeah, that's kind of, that's no good. That stinks. Yeah, they're right here and they're all coming off. Because they have gotten that foam behind them. Well, I can fix that. No biggie. I'll put that there. Okay, that's the unboxing. And that's it. So, I'll put the box to the side. <coughs> and we'll get, we'll get started on the assembly. So let's find our happiness. This is great. Let me see if I can get a close up of this. You like that? Look at that happiness inside, not the instructions. I guess it's happiness because you can understand how to put it together. Let's get this box and put it over here out of the way. So let's get at it. I'll uh, put the camera on a time lapse and we'll go. Let's see. I believe it comes with all the. Uh, yeah, it comes with the tools you need
here it is uh, completed and everything went pretty well I uh, don't have any complaints the only thing that I don't really like about this unit is um, you see here these are stickers that are here these look pretty good here they've got that that foam stuck on them I have to try to get that off but um, here one has already come off and they came off in the box so uh, they apparently were not stuck on very good see this one's peeled up a bit and it's got that foam underneath it they weren't stuck on that well so that would be my only complaint but other than that everything went together really nicely see this has got the foam all over it and some stuck on the stickers here yeah, see we're missing one here also uh, so that that would be my only gripe about it but uh, that's minimal for the most part it went together uh, really easy so there it is I hope you enjoyed this video it was a quick one and remember to press that like button. I know I say that all the time, but it really helps me out and uh, lets the YouTube algorithms know that uh, I'm producing videos that people like. Also, remember to subscribe if you haven't already subscribed and ring that bell notification so that anytime I post a new video, uh, it will be, you will be notified.